watching Caffeine and Pixie Dust. Have a wonderful day. Hello and welcome back to Caffeine and Pixie Dust and welcome to another instalment in the Sense of Disney playlist. If you are new to this playlist, it's bursting full of videos to help you guys to find that practically perfect scent to take you back into a very special Disney memory. Whether it be like hopping on your favourite Disney ride or catching your favourite Disney parade or just in general to kind of evoke the magic of being on a very special Disney holiday, hopefully watching the series of videos will help you find the perfect scent for you. So as you might be able to tell from sparkly pumpkins <laughs> and my beautiful sparkly villainous ears from Hannah Marie Magic, who I will of course link below in the show notes, I'm feeling a little bit autumnal. I am, I'm feeling a bit Halloween-y and a little bit ready for this time of year because I love autumn. I love everything about it. I love going out and crunching the autumn leaves. I love going out blackberry picking and just cozying up as well because during the summer we all run around doing everything and you know what, as the nights get darker earlier, it's nice just to shut the door, close the curtains, hunker down, watch a movie, Disney of course, and just enjoy that special time and being cozy and eating treats and all those good things. So um, this is quite a special video as well because as well as being full of gorgeous Halloween scents it's a little bit different because if you've watched my other videos in this playlist you'll know that all of the scents I feature I've purchased myself. I purchase them because I'm addicted to scents, um, especially Disney ones, but also I really enjoy the process of kind of sniffing them, reviewing them and sharing them with you guys because I always feel it's quite hard to get a, get a sort of a handle on what a scent is like when you're just reading a description online. So I like to have a bit of a sniff and then share my reviews with you. But today I have actually been sent a bundle, I've been gifted a bundle from Maple and Whiskey Candle Company who I absolutely adore. Um, they have a page on Etsy and they're based in Colchester and everything is made by hand and made beautifully and they've sent some gorgeous Halloween scents for us to enjoy. But they've also sent another little gift, which is for you guys, which is a discount code. So I will leave the details in the show notes below. Um, but until the end of the year, you are able to get 10% off any um, purchase over £10. So hopefully after watching this video and some of the other videos in my playlist that feature this brand of scents and candles and all those lovely things, you can go and have a look and save yourself some money while making your home smell delicious. Um, so yeah, just to let you know, they've sent me these scented wax melts because they know that I absolutely adore this way of scenting our home. So what I do is I actually pop these cubes, they look like little chocolate bars almost, pop one of these off and put them into an electric warmer um, like this one and just fill your home with a gorgeous, gorgeous scent. You can also use them with the tea light warmers as well, just remember to blow that flame out. Um, but Maple & Whiskey also do uh, some beautiful room diffusers, which I really want to try because I've got into room diffusers recently. And they also do room sprays, not going to lie, I'll probably end up wanting to wear it as a perfume, you know what I'm like about Disney. Um, but they also do some beautiful candles with a choice of wicks, so you can have like a cotton wick, but then you can also have a wood wick, which I really love the idea of because, especially at this time of year, the idea of hunkering down with a beautiful scent going, but also that sort of slight crackling of wood and sort of, yeah, it'd be beautiful and we haven't got a fire so that's as close as we're going to get so there's loads and loads of choices loads and loads of scents but today it's all about halloween so let's get stuck in without further ado because i can't wait so the first one i'm going to show you look at the color of that perfect pumpkin orange is called halloween town i'm just going to move my face so you can see the label there we go now just to explain as well i'm going to do something a bit weird <laughs> <laughs> I believe as you warm these waxes to get the scent out, it's only fair when you're kind of having a sniff that you warm them as well, because I believe you get like a cold sniff, which is when you first smell it, but then if you give it a rub, you're actually releasing all of the scent from it, you're kind of smelling it at its full potential, and I think that's only fair. So if you see me rubbing the wax, that's what I'm doing, I've not lost the plot, so I'm giving this one a good rub. Ah, oh, pumpkin spice! <laughs> This is pumpkin spice. If you love your pumpkin spice latte, like I love my pumpkin spice latte, then do give this a whirl. This is gorgeous, it's beautiful. It's kind of got that definite pumpkin smell in it, but the pumpkin spice, which if you hadn't before, haven't had it before, is a mix of like nutmeg, cinnamon, ginger, all those lovely warming scents, a very slight bit of vanilla in it maybe, but definitely the cinnamon, nutmeg and ginger are there because they warm it right up and that's what you get in this. 
so it's sweet but it's not like whew, sweet it's just like a lovely cozy autumnal feel and I think this would be absolutely beautiful to have in like the hallway and the sitting room and maybe any other shared living spaces because it's definitely Halloweeny it's definitely autumnal but it's not too overpowering sweet you know so yeah if you love those lovely comforting spices then definitely give this a whirl so there you go that is Halloween town and the next one I have to show you oh, look at the colors together beautiful and they match my ears goodness me is headless horseman and I'm gonna try and zoom in on this so you can see the label because it's fantastic it's got little bats on it little bats flying through a starry sky and I love the color it's like a beautiful dark grape color there you go so let's give this a rub oh goodness that's beautiful so that is a really really sharp contrast to the kind of spices and the slight sort of mellow sweetness of Halloween Town. This is like tart but a beautiful kind of juicy scent as well. You know it makes the, like, the back of your mouth water <laughs> because it's like there's a deep orange scent in there. So and I'm not talking like a juicy orange like orange juice but when you zest an orange that kind of bitter tart but beautifully aromatic scent but it's also got like a kind of deep mellow fruitiness. It reminds me, here you go, I know it's Halloween, but it reminds me, you know when you get those great big oranges and you put cloves in them? You get that fruitiness, but you also get that beautiful dark sort of spiciness to it. It's the same with this. It's got a lovely, lovely deep scent. It's got definite sort of cinnamon, maybe apple scents in there, but I really also get that kind of spiciness. And I don't know how they do this. <laughs> They're gonna have to tell me how they do it. They've made this smell cool. It's kind of got almost like a, a slight frostiness in the background so that, you know when you go out on an autumn morning and it's quite, quite cold, you get that from this because it's a sort of cool, mellow fruitiness. It's really intriguing. And I think that that would be a lovely transition scent. So if you've had lots and lots of kind of pumpkin-y, spicy, cinnamony smells, to then warm this as you're coming through kind of Halloween and going into the start of December into proper winter as it were this would be really nice because it's got echoes of those spices but you're also going through for that kind of slightly wintry smell so Headless Horseman is beautiful I can't wait to warm that and then the next one I have has got straight up the cutest label I have ever ever seen because it's covered in candy corns look at that how sweet is that there we go and again it's a lovely kind of pumpkin orange I can smell it already it's beautiful it's absolutely beautiful I'm gonna give it a rub though just to be fair I want to eat it <laughs> I'm not going to because it'd be weird oh wow that is everything that is yummy it's marshmallow it's caramel it's like a buttery brown sugar caramel and it's got vanilla in it as well it's a really really comforting cozy sweet smell and it's familiar as well I think it's the kind of vanilla in there and the caramel and the marshmallow it just smells really really cozy it smells like the perfect scent to have when you're hunkered down with a hot chocolate with marshmallows that's beautiful and it does smell of candy corn I have had them years ago but I do remember it's got that kind of scent the marshmallowy caramel kind of buttery sweetness and you know, this would be perfect. I can't stop sniffing it, sorry. <laughs> this would be perfect for Halloween where you've got the trick-or-treaters coming to the door and you open the door and they'll just get this waft of marshmallow, gooey, vanilla, caramel smells. The only problem is I might well need to keep my sweeties stocked up because if they're smelling this lovely sweet smell, <laughs> they'll be digging into them. But that's a beautiful scent. And I also think it would be really nice as well as kind of a hallway, living room, kitchen, that type of stuff, this would be really nice in the bedroom. If you've got like an electric warmer you could pop on, safety first, safety smart, um, you could pop this in maybe a little while before you go up to bed and you'll go up to your bedroom and it will just smell cozy and familiar and warm because of that kind of vanilla scent in it. So that's a really, really beautiful autumnal Halloween-y scent. So there we go, there's our lovely Halloween scents. Can we just, the colours together, purple and orange, absolutely beautiful. I hope you've enjoyed them. I've really enjoyed sniffing them. I can't wait to warm them. Thanks again to Maple and Whiskey for sending these waxes and thank you for the discount code, which I hope you guys are gonna enjoy. As I said, I'll pop it in the show notes below. 
What I'd love to know before I close off this video is what your favourite kind of autumnal scent is. Have you got a scent that always just makes you want to cosy up and watch some kind of scary film or a Disney film? <laughs> Do let me know because I'm always on the lookout for more scents. But for now, I can't wait to get stuck into these. So as usual, I hope you've enjoyed this video. If so, please do leave me a sparkly pumpkin-y thumbs up, share, comment, subscribe, all those wonderful things, and I'll see you again next time. Take care.